She got it. I got your juicy entertainment news for Friday. I'm sure by now you've heard about the Astro World Festival tragedy.、Uh, it's been in the headlines for the last few weeks. Ten people tragically died, and hundreds more were injured. And the blame was placed on the performers. Well, now a $2 billion lawsuit against Travis Scott, Drake, Apple Music, Live Nation, and NRG Stadium has been filed on behalf of 282 victims. Now, the suit claims that the defendants stood to make an exorbitant amount of money off this event, and they still chose to cut corners, cut costs, and put attendees at risk. The victims want to ensure that the defendants are held responsible for their actions, and they want to send a message to all performers, event organizers, and promoters that what happened at Astro World cannot happen again. Now, this is just one of the many lawsuits that have been filed. Another one was filed on Tuesday on behalf of more than 120 victims, including Axel Acosta, who died at the festival. The suit named several organizations, including Apple Music and Epic Music, claiming that they stood to profit from the event, and the suit is seeking $750 million. So it's going to be interesting to see what comes out of this, but there's a lot of lawsuits being filed. Chrissy T.、Um, and check it out, Mike Tyson.、Um Had to have sex before his fights so he wouldn't kill his opponents. Yes, this is the latest juice coming out from his former bodyguard and chauffeur, Rudy Gonzalez, who spilled the beans on Tyson's secret、um, in an interview to mark Mike's 35th anniversary of becoming the youngest boxer ever to win a heavyweight title. 20 year old Mike Tyson destroyed Trevor Burbick in round two to make history in the title fight on November 22nd in 1986. Now, Ruby worked for Mike back then. And And said one of the greatest secrets with Mike was that he needed to have sex in the dressing room right before the fight. He said he had to find groupies, it didn't matter who they were.、Um, he said Mike just needed to get laid to disengage some of his strength that he had. So Rudy would have girls tucked away in bathrooms and changing rooms. He said Mike's biggest fear was that he would kill somebody in the ring, and he knew that he could do it. Rudy said Mike was like a train in the ring hitting those guys, and having sex was his way of disengaging that power and loosening up a bit. And someone also once asked to him, Why does Mike need four armed bodyguards? And Rudy said, We're not here to Protect him. We're here to protect you from him. Rudy Gonzalez's book, The Inner Ring, that he wrote back in 1995 about his Tyson experiences, is being developed into an animated movie. And that's your juicy entertainment news for Friday. Lock it in again on Monday for more of the juice right here on the all new Kiss 96.